The large public health system of Tarrant County in Fort Worth, Texas meets the varied needs of their staff, providing private milk expression space that can be found in all of their 19 buildings. If women work out of their vehicle, they have privacy screens for automobiles and breast pump power adapters available. Even family members are supported. Dads, grandmothers and other family members can all access breast pumps for nursing women. Tarrant County Public Health Department Lactation uh, Program Worksite Lactation Program involves um, a policy that supports the employee that is returning from maternity leave to come back to work and to breastfeed at work. It's really important to have the people at the top of the organization on board with things and the higher up in the organization you can get the support, the more success you're going to have when you implement your policy. One of the most important things about lactation program that I want to express to all businesses is that it's a very doable thing. And the best way to do that is to look at other agencies that are similar in nature and emulate what they've done. The program has grown quite a bit in the last couple of years. And we don't uh, just have a place on site for people to support uh, the breastfeeding, but also provide pumps for them to take home with them as well as shields for our field workers to be able to kind of cover up their cars when they're out in the field pumping. We educate all of our new employees during new employee orientation. We have materials and campaign materials, brochures, emails, newsletters that go out periodically to tell our employees about the Works of Lactation program. Uh, the policy that we developed really is, is for all employees. And most of the hourly employees are the ones who have that face-to-face -face contact that when they're away pumping, it impacts the workload. So our policy, for example, says that women will be allowed to have time to pump uh, during their work day, but at the same time, it's a two-way street. So we expect the women who are returning to work to also discuss their plans with their supervisor so that the first day back to work isn't a big surprise for everybody. I have spoken with my supervisor about my breastfeeding plans and there is support there not just from my supervisor's standpoint but also from my colleagues on my team. Well my plan first was to just breastfeed my baby the first three months. Then the three months it went by and it was easier for me. So the six months um, I was like it will be just the six months. But everything was so easy. I was used to it and now my baby was getting healthier, bigger. So I went all the way to 10 months. As a dad who's had the wonderful benefit of having a wife that wanted to and was able to breastfeed, I see the value in it. It's a uh, wonderful thing to have and it gives the kids a leg up that otherwise nothing else can replace. I feel so supported in my breastfeeding and I know that I'm here for the long term. I know that I'll be able to continue to be a productive employee while maintaining my breastfeeding. To have these facilities is just amazing. Being a public health department, you want what's best for children. Health starts when they're young. If you can develop that foundation, like with the lactation program, it puts them one step ahead towards a healthier living, healthier lifestyle, and an overall healthier community. We have a lot to do to change the culture of breastfeeding. And I have a daughter. And so my hope and dream one day is that when she comes to work, that she looks at me and says, what do you mean mom, I didn't breastfeed at work? I want it to be so natural and normal that she doesn't have to fight the barriers that we fight today. You too can support nursing women at your business. Learn how to make it work at www.womenshealth.gov slash breastfeeding slash at hyphen work. Supporting nursing women at work is good for business. Three to one return on investment, helps recruit and retain good employees, lowers absenteeism rates, improves productivity, builds employee morale and loyalty. Funded by the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services Office on Women's Health. HHS has designed these videos solely for the purpose of providing examples of the ways businesses accommodate nursing women. Please contact your state labor department to assure that solutions comply with your state laws. HHS does not imply endorsement of any one strategy for compliance with the break time for nursing mothers provision of the federal law. All persons pictured in these videos have provided permission for use of their likeness for federal purposes only. Commercial business scenes do not imply endorsement by HHS.